Oh, welcome back, and a girl is in the French rules. It's Tuesday, and you're like, wait a minute, Donald, we don't see you here today. What's going on? And I want to start a new video series where I go back and take a look at one of my more stronger and popular decks and see how well it goes through the tournaments. Now, I'm going to be making tweaks, making it better, and the very first one on the list is going to be Mega Sceptile Malamar, and I think this is one of my strongest of the newer decks. You're going to see what changes I make to it and see it go through tournament matches and see if I get some packs. So, uh, let me close this out, and if you want to know, I have a playlist, tournament decks, decks I think have some competitive edge to it. They've at least been through a tournament or mostly I think they can handle one. So it's right here. Now let's move on to the deck of the day where let me take this window capture out and this is the new revised deck. Now just going over much faster since you've probably already seen the base part of this deck. I have Septile EX, very slow energy cost, first attack if heads, uh, the active Pokemon sleep and poison. And which combos into second attack, two energies, 130 damage if there's any special condition on defending Pokemon. Now, when it Mega evolves into Mega Sceptile, it gets a little bit weaker in damage, but you can add two more grass energies and put them onto your bench. So, up to three energies per turn, as well as completely healing off something that's wounded. And it also has a stop effect where Pokemon abilities sort of don't affect it depending on which one. So that's Mega Sceptile and its combo is Malamar EX. Now it helps both Sceptile's version because whenever you put energy on this, uh, defending Pokemon goes to sleep and that counts as a special condition for Sceptile EX. Now for Mega Sceptile, it can just overload this with grass energies and it becomes like a super dangerous high damage. Malamar, so he really just steals the show because he it's the real powerhouse here even though Sceptile can really help and blend that bit out. Now most of the deck engine is still the same. I'm using Shauna's, I'm using Tiano's because I don't really want to discard or reshuffle cards back. I really want a lot of grass energies in my hand because Sceptile, Mega Sceptile, they especially Mega Sceptile needs those grass energies. And I'm running a little bit less Ultra Balls now because well, I don't really want this carding, but I really need the accuracy sometimes, so that's there. I'm running Great Balls because, you know, just I don't have to discard anything, although sometimes it's a miss or hit. But I, sometimes I don't really mind if I get Sceptile or Malamar or anything, so the accuracy is something I can handle. Now, what else is new? I'm running Double Colors Energy now. It only helps really Malamar, but, you know, it can use this too in an emergency. But the burst, the sheer power to charge Malamar without Mega Sceptile is the versatility I really like. like Sceptile didn't start out in front, Malamar is up front, that's fine, we'll just use double colors energies now. And that's what's new, and oh, Enhanced Hammer. I think this is one thing that's going to be very useful in the meta. Double colors energy is extremely popular, double dragon energy, bit there. So this, you're definitely going to see it help out in the matches coming up ahead. So, these are the basic changes. This is how the deck works overall. Just to review if I uh, haven't seen it in a while. Oh, the Crushing Hammer. I just threw this in just for fun. You know, just for luck. You can get away any energies and, you know, set them back by one turn. So, a little bit of broken momentum there. And now, today, I'm just going to show you three matches. They're going to be tournament matches. First one is going to be a bit of warm up, and you're going to wonder why. What are your only two matches? And you're going to see why what happened, even though they're in the standard booster pack tournament. So, let's get started. Let me show you how well this upgraded. Welcome deck. to another Mega Sceptile match where, you know, I bet Malamar is just going to open up every game. Hmm. So, Malamar, yet again, you're going to be. Or you, yet will be a first starting Pokemon and let's see what we're up against nice Hoopa deck skin probably not Hoopa though because you want that in your back line it's gonna be a best between evolution match so now I actually need a dark energy so let's go ahead and play this grab uh, some dark energies yep there we go yep 
great ball, and you know I hopefully I can pull something that pull it, so pull something at all. So let me put down this on Malamar. This is Combius is asleep, and just one heads of a coin flip. It's going now. You know what? I think I can get a better hand. These aren't the cards I want. I'd rather have Trick Coin, Double Color, Sceptile. Hmm, not too bad. So maybe this Great Ball again? Okay, so. We're definitely gonna have to pull that off again. Now, that's it for now. Kombi, are you gonna wake up? This Kombi's like, yes, I'm awake. I don't wanna be awake because when that thing hits me, it's, it's gone. Now he cannot evolve this turn. And he's got, or she's got two unknowns, and she's not Cyril, by the way. What? You can't evolve this turn unless you got something special. Like, that special thing would be a particular stadium. I don't think she drew it. This Kombi is like, uh, guys, I can't evolve this turn. Why would you give me this double colors energy? There's only four you can have. And, you know, maybe Malamar may not be able to get heads, like all heads. Go Lurk? Golurk? So this is like an evolution and Golurk deck. That's decent spin, but she does not have too many cards in her discard pile. So we'll see actually how this pulls off. Unknown goes down. Both of them go down. So there's some cards in the discard. You gotta play that battle compressor though. Maybe throw away the evolutions that you don't need, which is everything but Flareon. So Combi is like, whoops, guys. So we're gonna, wow, I got the whole Mega Sceptile line right here. I don't want to Shauna this off yet, so let me go ahead and grab the energies that I'll need. A grass and a grass, yes. So, Kobe is gonna go to sleep. But, unless it evolves into Vespa Queen, which I think she probably has, it's okay. So, give me one heads, just one heads, Maximar. Do not be both tails. Just do not be both, both tails, both tails are gonna, oh. Ooh, ooh, there we go. So. Bye bye Vespa Queen with the double colors energy and I got my lucky hammer. Now Gorlorcus, I got this guys. I got a week this is the dark folk line yet I'm coming out. I am now a Golurk, which also has a weakness, so if I get you know what? he has a little bit more hit points, so two heads. Alright, level ball, what do you need now? Jolteon. You should be getting a Flareon, but well, what do you do? So this thing needs I need tons of energy, guys. Tons and tons of energies, but we'll, we'll see if we can knock it off. It needs double colors energy. Smite charge to them. Dimension Valley. And there's a water energy. Wa mm, okay. So, let's see if we can knock this off. Just for the heck of it. Yeah. So, alright, Vespa Queen. We're gonna take you down. We're gonna take you out. Well, Vespa Queen's out here. We're gonna take you out. Go alert. Now, Hyper Hypnosis is not going to work due to the stop ability, so it's not it's not too sleepy of a Golurk. Alright, that's it. And another Sceptile, we'll just go ahead and drop it down. Drop you down too. And I need three heads to knock it out. Yeah, this is why the next energy is going on to Malamar. Yeah, go sleep. You know what, I have a Crushing Hammer. I don't really need to save it. And it's not even going to work too. So this is the Defective Hammer. Last card in my hand, gonna be Shauna. So, Shauna, yes. Give me a new entire hand. Like it's just a bit a trick coin. Perfect. So, Maximar, go ahead and use your Maximar attack. Call it Maximar. It's actually Malamar. My real name's Maximar, guys. Yeah. Here. So, two heads, that is exactly. I can't knock it out. You know what? Go for three heads. Go for three heads. Yes, one more head. Yes, come on, one more head, please. Three heads. There you go. Luck of the draw. Could have been all tails, but it one shot at it. Malmar's is like, you can trust me. I see. I got it. I got it. So, Jolteon's gonna come out as like, guys, I can't do this, and it will it is vulnerable to sleep. By the way. So, in order to stay in the game, she needs to put more bench Pokemons out. I think that's it. Well, Malamar, you're the man. You're the man. Everybody. Let us begin the first match of the tournament. I'm starting off with Malamar. I see a professor's letter. That's going to get me a dark energies, double colors, and a trick coins. 
And I also have an enhanced hammer just in case something unusual comes out. So I see there's a Mega Rayquaza that wants the double colors energy. This thing also wants double colors energy, and you know, I, I think this is the right card to help help shut it down. So we'll see if he actually pulls him. Now it'd be safer if he put a regular energy right on his first turn, so I wouldn't be able to use this until it's like it's too late. But I think I got this in the bag, guys. Well, let's not say anything yet. So, Buffalon does... Wow, more damage to grass Pokemon. That's just appropriate for against my deck, because I got a Sceptile and Derail. Yeah, it reduces special energy, and I am using this. So, if it manages to survive against Malmar, oh, then we'll have to worry about it. So, he has... Oh, it looks like Mega Rayquaza, or Rayquaza is going to be the Pokemon. So... Let me go ahead. I did not draw any dark energies, but now I do. So there is the dark energy I need. And we're going to go ahead and just put this down. Go to sleep, Buffalon. Yep. You know, he can discard my trick coin. That's fine. It's just a trick coin. Yeah. I'll end my turn. And, oh, it wakes up. So the Afro Bull is like, nope, I'm going to stay awake. I'm not sure if I really want to stay awake or not, but yeah. Man, I really need a Lysander or an escape room. It seems that he may get the first hit on me, but I may be able just to take about one shot. So, Malamar is a little bit afraid of the dragon in the back, so let's go ahead and put this on. Yeah, and we're going to attack Maximar. I just need two heads. I think I'll get it. One more heads, one more heads, otherwise I'm reflipping. Oh, that's it. Yeah, no, 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 this is perfect. 120 damage. Now, there's Escape Bro. He's gonna send Rayquaza up to the field. Now, it's not a Mega Rayquaza. It cannot one-shot me, but I can one-shot him. All right, all three energies, none of them were double colors, even though he has double co colors deceleration on all his Pokemon. See Rayquaza, see Toxicroat right there, and even Golurk and Golette. It's not Golurk yet. So now he can use Dragon Poles. That's gonna get three cards. No, he does not use Dragon Poles. What? I guess he didn't want to do the discard. Now let's see if I have anything uh, to help out. I have a Malamar, but let me see if I can get a Sceptile. With... Perfect! Sceptile, which is put down with the Spirit Link. So he cannot one shot me without something special help. And you know, why don't you go to sleep? And not only that, should I put this Malamar down? Oh, I need to play uh, Tierno. I got a Verse Seeker. Yep, give me more cards. Nope, I can't do it because I already played a supporter. So, three heads, please. No. If it's not three heads, I'm reflipping. One more. One more. Come on, one more, please. Yes! Nope. Bye bye, Rayquaza. Malamar, you're the man. High five, man. Malamar is just. Yes. I got you. And now, oh no, do not poison me. I may just have to escape rope and pull in a uh, septile. He's got the double colors energy. And this poison, it's gonna hurt a lot. I Maybe I'll retreat, maybe I'll just, like, eh, whatever, take it out. He's gonna play an Ultra Ball for what? What, what else What else does he got in his uh, plan? Gallade, okay. Gallade, I can handle that. I can handle that. So I'm poisoned. I can retreat, and then I can try to maybe heal myself with a Sceptile or Mega Sceptile, which I have right here. So am I gonna play it safe? Yes, I'll play it safe. I'll play the Escape Rope, and whoever's out here is not ready to go. So choose. Yep, Sengolet. That's fine, and we'll charge you up with the single energy and. I'll go ahead and discard this off you. Yeah, perfect. Now, I can play... No reason to play Lysander yet. Lysander, so just play Tierno. And we're going to use Sleep Poison. Come on, it doesn't matter. Oh, well, Heads is, Heads is fine. So, it's poisoned. It's going to go down next turn, but I may not... Well, I have three prize cards, so I pretty much... Why not take this free shit? And not only that... This is going to get completely healed up and, well, get even stronger. So, he's 
charging up his Gallade now. Why Gallade? Well, I guess Piercing Prizes has a... Oh, I can one-shot you. Well, maybe I might just retreat in a bit and just take out Mega Sceptile. No, 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 he cannot one-shot Mega Sceptile, so it's good that this guy is up in front. Oop, it became a Mega Gallade. Oh, okay, so it can use Unwavering Blade if he's got the Stadium and one more energy, but damage is not there. So, let me go ahead, evolve this to Mega Sceptile, and we're gonna charge up Malamar at the same time. So, let me go ahead and, yeah, I'll use Jagged Saber. Now, he already has a lot of energies, so I'm just gonna get one, hopefully. Yep, and, no, it's already gone. I don't need to put it to sleep. I'll save the last energy, and I'll take uh, my prize card. So now, Malamar, I'm definitely gonna bring it up front. Try to one-shot whatever he brings out. Probably I can just retreat Lysander. Not so safe, but I think I got this. There's no way the game's gonna end next turn. Unless, like, roll for all heads. But my luck is so awesome, guys. And Malamar's like, you can trust me. I'll get you those heads. So... Mega Gallade's gonna come out. It may or may not be able to attack. Now he needs the Dimensional Valley, otherwise it's just gonna be like, uh, guys, give me more energy. Okay, so there we go. Um, you know what? I may be bold and just retreat and just end the game right here. Here's a bold move. We're gonna retreat. We're gonna bring you this Toxic Road out because it has a little bit less hit points. And I just need three heads as opposed to four. Go to sleep, and I think this is it. Max Malamar, you got this, man. Tails. Tails. Heads, there we go, man. Give me another heads. Three heads, just three heads. Otherwise, we're fully flipping. All right, one more head, one more head. You can do this. Five tails. Malamar, I trusted you. Do that again. Do it right this time. So, one heads. There you go. Two heads. Three, finally. So, doesn't matter what the coin flips are. I did extra. Oh, this one taken out Galley as well. So, yeah, 300 damage. Two prize cards, and that is the first tournament round. So, we'll be moving on. Oop, I got the grass quest as well. Now, let's take a look at how we're doing. Oop, one more opponent to go, and um, we'll be moving to second round. So. I'll Welcome see you. to round two. Now, my psychic powers tell me that it's Tails, but it's gonna be Tails, so I'm definitely correct. Now, in that case, I'll be going first. And the only three Pokemon I can, well, two Pokemon I can start off with is Sceptile and Malamar. No shamans, no worries. And it's gonna be Malamar again. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna steal the show, but, you know, I really wanna start off with Sceptile instead. Sorry, Malamar. Don't tell him that, though. He's like, I heard that. I heard that. You're a jerk. So, Malamar gonna go up front, and I'm gonna be able to put my opponent to sleep right on the first turn. And hey, I just got another Enhance Hammer. Okay. So, let's let's see what I'm up against with. Now, I really want more Pokemon, so Tierno, I know you only give me three cards, but please give me like an Ultra Ball or something. Great Ball, Pokemon. Because Malamar doesn't like to be by himself. He's like, this bench is empty. Alright, prize cards. Do not bench all my Pokemon. It's Rayquaza. Man, he is popular. So, there we go. Oh, I can even Sceptile. I can open up with Sceptile or Malamar. You know what? I like Sceptile. So, let's go ahead and play this escape rope. Charge him up. And let him know what's going on. So, there we go. Malamar is like, what? Why'd you switch me out? And I'm like, ah, he loves me better. I know, I love you better. Oh, what the heck? It's a this robo substitute. That's gonna be a little annoying. So, double colors, energy acceleration is what I'm afraid of. I let him charge up an extra turn. Ooh, whoo. All right, Winno. Ooh, Winona. He's like, yeah, you really should have put me up front. I don't know why you switch off that Sceptile. It's jealous. Rayquaza, Shaman, and Lugia. Oh boy. So this bench is going to be quite filled and if he can Mega Evolve his first turn so I won't be able to deny a first hit. And why is it all black? Oh, there we go. That's how you fix it. So, it can attack me with Intensifying Bird the first turn and that's going to hurt. But you know, it might go to sleep. Might go to sleep. 
and we'll see uh, that. And one. he's Mega Vault, Mega Rayquaza without Spirit Link, but he didn't really need it. So, here we go. And more energies. It's grass energy, so I'll put this on Sceptile. We're gonna go ahead and use, or maybe I should draw. I'm gonna use Sleep Poison. Go to sleep. It's gonna be Tails though, so. Whoa! So if I just say Tails, it's gonna be head. So it's exactly what I want. Stay asleep now. Stay asleep. Yes! Yes! So I won't be able to one shot this, but I'll deal a significant amount of damage to this, and then it's gonna be near near gone, which is perfect. Now he cannot one shot me until he fills up six of his bench. And he decided instead of attacking me, he evolved Mega Rayquaza, which I don't know. I guess he didn't have a spirit link. Switch, bring out the Robo Substitute I have. Oh, oh, what a combo. But look, that reduced his bench space. Okay, but you know what? I got a plan. We're gonna use the Enhance Hammer. So if he does not have a double colorless energy, he's in a bad position. And, you know, I've learned my lesson. Let's just put a regular energy. Put you to sleep. Go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. And we're going to use Unseen Claw. 130 damage. You know, at this point, my Malamar can easily take it. And it's still asleep. Sleep away, Mega Rayquaza. It's not like he didn't have a bench for it. Now, I think he's going to go for whatever plan B is. And my Sceptile may or may not just survive. So, um, guys, I, I need another card. You guys are, you heard that, right? Switch again. Gonna save the Rayquaza and send out Lugia. Now, I can Lysander and pull it out. Do I want to? Do I want to? But it looks like he's stuck, so I may just want to take advantage of the situation. But, you know, more cards is always good. So, I'm gonna pull it out. We're gonna charge up Malamar yet again. This will uh, trigger the sleep, and when it's asleep, you can use Unseen Claw. Bye-bye, Mega Rayquaza. So, there we go. Trick coin, Great Ball, gonna pull me into something awesome. So now, needs a double colors energy. Gonna, did not have a double color, so he's charging up belt. So, I might be able to escape rope and pull out a Shaman or you. I'm not ready, don't think I'm ready to do that, so let's just keep on attacking this. Now, I'm gonna hold my hand. Let's play this Omega Sceptile. So, do I want to go Mega yet? Do I want to go Mega yet? This is a hard decision. No, I don't want to go Mega. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and use this energy. I don't... I rather prefer a second Sceptile go Mega, so that might happen. And let me go ahead and put you to seat. Unseen Claw, 130 damage. And it's gonna stay asleep. Awesome. So I'm just gonna take a free Lugia, and then maybe I'll just Lysander free Shaman if it comes out. Now these are just junk Pokemons. Oh, he moved some of those damage counters to Malamar? So it's a little bit softened. Verse Seeker, are you gonna get Lysander? No, you're gonna play Winona. And then maybe he's gonna bring out Rayquaza again. I don't know. Lugia, Rayquaza, but not Mega Rayquaza. Okay. So. Coin flip, it doesn't matter if you wake up, you're still asleep. That's just fine. So, I think that's it. Let me go ahead and play this. Let's just take another dark energy and this. Okay. Now, the integrity of this uh sceptile. Hmm. I don't know. Let's let's I think I got this. I'm gonna be a little bit uh more bold and just mega evolve it right now. Let's go ahead and use. Oh, I need to attach an energy. So, another dark energy for you. Go to sleep some more, even though you're already asleep. And then we'll take 100 damage. Yeah, I'll take uh, another energy and make this Super Malamar and completely heal it up. And it's got tons of energy, so I'll save it. I'll save it just in case, you know, I need them. So, not cards. More energies, that's just fine. But not the cards that I want right now. I kind of want another Sceptile, you know. So this way he's like, who should I send out? I Velto's like, um, guys, you see that thing back here? I really don't like the squid at all. And so he's gonna send out Tornadus, which will will survive one turn. So let's see. I do not have a Lysander, something I need. I still don't have Lysander, and you know I can Professor Lair for more energies. 
Let's let's uh let's just take it out. Here we go. Jagged saber. Do I really want to dump all the energies on there? Yeah, let's make a super Malamar. Yep, go to sleep some more. And yep, I'll take this one too. Really, really big Malamar with a trick coin. There's nothing is gonna come out next turn, guys. So yet. No, it can't come out next turn because Tornadus. Yeah. Is didn't go down yet. A little too soon, a little too soon there, so. Beltel's coming out. Oh man, if he Lysander's Malamar, that would be bad. So maybe I should should I be a little bit worried? I got this. Enhanced hammer. That's gonna What? You he has a special energy? Yeah, well let's go ahead and take that off. And Yep, I think that's it. You know, just in case he has a Lysander, I'm just gonna keep this energy. Yeah, crushing hammer. The lucky crushing hammer. So he, I have one prize card. Send out your best. Send out Velto. If you send anything else, I'm just gonna take it out. Definitely gonna escape rope or retreat. Prefer to escape rope, but I think he knows this is really the end of the line. So, yep, come on. Take whatever. This is this is it. So Velto, how many energies did he need to one shot me? Velto's out on the plate. Pull Lysander and it's oh pull Lysander. No! What a jerk! What a jerk! I was being too cocky, so that that that's what you get. So let me see. Let me play a uh, crushing hammer and reduce uh, reduces this thing's power. Nope, did not work. You know, let's play a Great Ball. I may need another second Pokemon. Yeah, there we go. And let's force him to retreat. Give me something. He cannot put this out. He cannot put this out, but he can put a Shaman out. And maybe uh, that was even, I've got a Verse Seeker in my hand. I can just Lysander it. And we're just gonna go for Shaman. You know, this will slow him down because he has to retreat if he wants to attack. No, there are no good choices. Bring your shaman out, man. Bring it out. You got nothing. So, um, I do have 160 hit points. I think I'll, that's enough to survive. So let me put this here. Put the shaman to sleep. And yep, go to sleep. I'll go ahead and put this trick coin. So, we'll just do jacket saber. And that's it. Mm, no, maybe. Go ahead and put this energy on. Yeah, okay. So, there we go. Malamar going to go. And yeah, you can go ahead and go to sleep again. So if it sleeps, then Hope is awake. So, he can retreat it. He can retreat it. He can retreat it. I got this. You know what? I should have just Lysander to Skarmory or something. Yeah. Why didn't I do that? So, I got this. Don't know what I was thinking there, but I got this that Malamar down there. It's like, why? Why'd you do this to me? He's blaming it on me now for being a little bit too cocky down there. But let's see what he's got. Professor Sycamore looks like, ooh, Rayquaza. Mega Rayquaza was in his hand. Got the retreat cost. Here comes a Robo Substitute. Now here comes a Verb Seeker and it's going to go for a Lysander. There we go. Lysander, we're gonna pull out the Shaman. Because that's what we were going for in the first place. And we'll just use Jagged Saber. Goodbye, Shaman. Two prize cards. Just one. There we go. Tournament round two. Sorry about that, Malamar. I was just a little too cocky. You knew he was, he was baiting me into it. No, he wasn't. He, I did that to myself. So, stay round three. Round three, guys. Is that. Oh, that's coming up! Let's Welcome to the exciting third round where my opponent was inactive for too long. Well, I'm sorry that was not anticlimactic, but yeah, that was first place. Spent my tournament ticket, so I don't think I can go back and film another one. So, there we go. It does its job. And, well, well. That's how it went, guys. The first of the series. Got my booster packs. Wish I could have played that last match for it.
but well, maybe I'm just a bit lucky or unlucky this time. Now, I do want to do this again, so Lucario EX will be returning back to compete in the tournament because I think this is also one of my stronger decks. So that's coming back hopefully next Tuesday on time. Now, this is the very first of the video series, so I'd like to hear back on more of what you think how this kind of video goes. I make new deck videos each week, but this is, I suppose, going back over the stronger, older ones and trying to make them more competitive. And this is what the goal of this video series is for. So let me know in the comments. Tell me on Facebook. I'll read both and see uh, what you think because these videos are really for you guys. So thank you, Ella Girls and the Frenchals, and I will see you. Probably next Friday. Yeah. Bye-bye.